Hello, this is Jason. Welcome to a complete VSDC video editing tutorial series. Once VSDC opens, close the opening splash screen. From the Start Project Now panel, click on Import Content. Navigate to your video files and choose any single video from your video library. then click open. The benefit of this method is that the project settings are set to match the media. The resolution and frame rate settings of the project automatically match the resolution and frame rate settings of the video file that you just imported. Name your project and click finish. The video clip appears on the timeline and a preview of the video clip appears in the video preview panel. You can enlarge the timeline by moving the border between the timeline and the video preview window. You can adjust the size of the video preview by moving the zoom slider at the bottom right. If you click on the zoom to screen button at the left of the zoom slider, the video preview will automatically resize to fit the panel. Each row in the timeline is a track. In VSDC, the tracks are like layers in photo editing software. You can place only one clip on each track. The only exception is a container called a sprite. A sprite can hold several media files. We will discuss sprites in other sections. The red line is referred to as a cursor, but is also called a scrubber. Moving this scrubber allows you to quickly preview a video clip. Use the mouse for quick scrubber position movements. Then use the right and left arrow keys on your keyboard for smooth video previews.